Door Opening Alarm A door opening alarm circuit is an indicator, or a security alert device, which activates while opening the door. Alarm remains on, as long as the door is kept open. For sensing the door position, different types of methods can be used, such as, magnetic, light beam, mechanical, electrical. Most commonly used method is by using a reed switch, which is simply a magnetic door alarm circuit. So, in this video, we will learn, how to make a door opening alarm. These are the components, which are needed in this project. One comparator IC, LM358, 8 pin IC base, 310 kilo ohm resistors, 1 kilo ohm resistor, 210 microfarad electrolytic capacitors, 1 red LED, 7805 voltage regulator, 1 buzzer, reed switch with magnet, 9 volt battery, PP3 battery connector, on off, rocker switch, 1 zero PCB, 4 screw with nuts, and 4 plastic spacers. Before making the project, we will understand its circuit diagram. This is a 9 volt battery, to power up the circuit. This is an on off switch, which is used to start or stop the project. This is a power supply indication LED. This is a current limiting resistor. 7805 voltage regulator is used to convert 9 volt DC into fixed 5 volt DC. While we use the circuit, the battery starts discharging and battery voltage starts decreasing, but 7805 maintains fixed 5 volt DC at its output unless the battery voltage goes below 7 volt. Two capacitors of 10 microfarad are used at the input and output of 7805 to avoid any fluctuations in the supply. LM358 is an 8-pin dual comparator IC. It compares the signal at its pin number 2 with the signal at pin number 3 and gives the output at its pin number 1 when the voltage at pin number 2 is higher than the voltage at pin number 3. Then it gives a low output at pin number 1 when voltage at pin number 2 is less than the voltage at pin number 3. Then it gives a high output, at pin number 1, two 10 kilo ohm resistors, are used in potential divider mode, and they gives 2.5 volt, at pin number 3 of the comparator. This is the symbol of read switch. Pin number 2 of IC, is connected with the read switch, when the door is closed, or magnet and read switch are closer to each other. Then read switch let the current to pass through it, and gives 5 volt at pin number 2 of IC. Now, comparator have 2.5 volt at pin number 3, and 5 volt at pin number 2, so it gives a low signal, at its pin number 1, a buzzer is connected at pin number 1. Therefore, as long as the door is closed, the buzzer remains silent, when someone opens the door, then the magnet moves away from the read switch and read switch cuts the connection between pin number 2, and positive supply voltage. Now this 10 kilo ohm resistor, gives the ground signal, at pin number 2. In this case, comparator have 2.5 volt at pin number 3, and 0 volt at pin number 2, so it gives a high signal, at its pin number 1, and buzzer starts beeping. These are the components, which we will use to make our project. First of all, we will make a PCB base, and for that, we will take a zero PCB, and make a hole at each of its corner. Now, we will insert a 1 inch screw, inside the hole. Now we will take a plastic spacer, and then we will use a nut to lock the spacer. Now our PCB base is ready. To switch on or off our project we will use an on off switch. We need to make a big hole to fit this switch on the PCB.
To protect the LED from high voltage and current, we will use a 1 kilo ohm current limiting resistor. We will solder a power indication LED on the PCB. Now we will solder the 10 microfarad electrolytic capacitor. Small pin of the capacitor is negative and long pin is positive. Now we will solder 7805 voltage regulator. It has three pins. First one is input pin, second one is ground pin and third pin is output pin. Now we will solder the 10 microfarad electrolytic capacitor. Now we will solder the 8 pin IC base. Now we will solder two 10 kilo ohm resistors one by one to make the voltage divider. Now we will solder the 10 kilo ohm resistor. This is a buzzer. Buzzer has two terminals, positive and negative. It has a sign of plus on its top. It shows that this side is positive and the other side is negative. Now we will solder this reed switch. Reed switch has no polarity, so we can mount it from either side. Now we will solder the PP3 battery connector. Connect the red wire with the positive terminal and black wire with the negative terminal in the circuit. Now we will insert the LM358IC in the 8-pin IC socket. Now we will connect the 9-volt battery and test our circuit. To test the circuit, we will mount a magnet on the door and fix the circuit on the side wall. When we open the door, then buzzer will beep. When read switch and magnet will come closer to each other, or the door is closed, then buzzer will kept silent.
our circuit is working perfectly. I hope you enjoyed the video and learned something from it. For any help or to clear your doubts regarding your project, you can contact us on our student care number 7007957715. To buy the items used in this project, you can visit our website www.erltech.com. You can give us the orders on WhatsApp also. Thank you so much.